have raised $135,000. How about that? Everybody's on the phone, and that's the way to be. Well, I am here with Michael Ruffin, and he's going to bump it up, folks. That's what I'm talking about. He is the regional director of AT&T, a New Orleans guy, and we are so happy to have you here. What do you have in your hand? Well, uh, it's a pleasure to be here with you all today. Uh, AT&T Louisiana is today publicly announcing a $50,000 check to uh, Second Harvest Food Bank of Greater New Orleans. Uh, one thing that we recognize is that uh, one in five uh, households are at risk of suffering from hunger. And a way to combat that challenge is that we want to be on the ground, we want to be on the front end, we want to be within the community, we want to make sure that not only we are providing financial support, but also all of our retail stores throughout the state of Louisiana are collecting non-perishable food items and donate them to food pantries and uh, uh, locations throughout the state of Louisiana. So we're proud to be here today. We're proud to be able to support our New Orleans City Council President, Helena Moreno, as well as support Second Harvest Food Bank. It's an honor to be here with you all today. So you guys are providing a worthy cause to a community that deserves a lot. So thank you guys so much. Oh, isn't this wonderful? Okay, well, we're social distancing, so you cannot hear Natalie J. Rowe. But in case anybody didn't hear how much you donated, would you step up to the I'm mic? I'm going to step it up and say it really, really loud. So today, AT&T Louisiana is donating $50,000 to the to Second Harvest Food Bank of Greater New Orleans in Acadiana. Oh, is that so cool? I uh, know, $50,000. Thank you, Michael. Hey, we're going to see you in a little while with an even bigger donation. Don't go away and keep on calling.